uh, non-operating income and expenses and brings you down to change in net assets this year of 944000 compared to 2049000 last year. Uh, the two biggest differences being gain on disposal of assets last year of um, $769,000. Um, that was the, the regal buyout, $750,000. And then the splash reimbursement last year of $491,000. You can see that uh, brings you down to net assets at the end of the year of $13,420,000 compared to $12,475,000 last year. Then we give you a little statement of net assets. You can see that the trend is um, you end the year with total assets of $26,689,000. And you can see that that's pretty level throughout the, the years. Um, what's not as level throughout the years is total liabilities. You can see those come down each year as you pay those bonds down. Um, so you end the year uh, with 13268000 which brings you back down to that total net assets of uh, 13420000 You can see that number kind of jumps around from year to year, but that's where you ended up last year. Okay. Any questions? I, I know the, uh, the, the top line of property taxes, when you go back to, to 2010, um, and the number was three million uh, eighteen thousand, and and we knew that it was going to, to take sort of a dive, and, uh, and and now I see it's coming back. Um, last year it was uh, uh, it was two million nine hundred and seventeen, and then I mean that's thirteen, and then in fourteen it was two million nine hundred and eighty, and so we're we're headed back to where it was in, in twenty ten, right. which is you know good for us. That's, so that's a good sign. Anything further? Thank you, gentlemen. Well, we appreciate the opportunity to form this, and uh, appreciate your help during during this, and Tom's help during this audit. So certainly do. We appreciate you, you all. Thank you. And right, let's move on to the marketing. <laughs>